All right, we are going to take round two at trying to record this video. The last one, the audio was completely jacked up, but doing a 4,000 mile review on the 2020 Street Bomb or FXBB, and more specifically, the Bassani Sweepers. Um, I absolutely love these pipes. There's a lot of talk online about two into ones and uh, puffer neutral there. A lot of talk online about two into ones and you know the performance gain that you get from the two into ones. But let me tell you, man, performance gains are one thing. Uh, no one here is street racing, but I am here to tell you from the back on this bike with the flow of the pipes and the seat. Hopefully that turns out okay on the GoPro with the tank. I've you know. Quite often I talk about how I'm not a fan of the three and a half gallon tank as you get further into performance you get less in the fuel economy and that becomes a problem. But these things are filthy. I love the way they look. I love the flow of the bike with them on there. Uh, and I love the way they sound. You know, um, Blockhead's one of the reasons I started this channel. And uh, I'm really interested to see what difference he gets from his... He just put the 131 on his bike. And... Uh, I'm interested to see the difference he gets from the Bassani sweepers on the dyno versus um, the two and the one that he hasn't revealed yet, but has revealed. Um, so anyway, we're going to fire it up, give a little sound clip. Do a little walk around the bike. One thing I do like about him is it shoots the sound, you know, the two and the ones and everything shoot your sound straight back. These are to the side and I'm typically in the fast lane when I'm driving. And it just lets the people know on that side of the bike, they're like, yo, I'm here. Um, huge bonus selling point to me. Uh, we'll jump on the bike and take it for a quick spin and you can kind of hear it shifting through the gears and then I'll get on it a little bit. But you know, plus 3000 RPMs, these things sing. And I absolutely love it. So we'll take it for a quick ride. Let you guys hear it out now as far as performance goes like i said there's a lot of talk about two into ones and how two into ones you get way better performance than you do two to twos um you know it's a huge performance loss so they say i don't know how much of a performance loss it is like i said i'm really interested to see what comes out of blockheads video but i don't notice a huge performance loss um you know, obviously the bike came with two into twos on it. Uh, you know, stock, all of them do. So I don't have much to compare it against. And, you know, it wouldn't surprise me if when I put the, if I were to go to switch to a two and a run, it wouldn't surprise me if there was a performance gain there. Um, I mean, it makes sense with the back pressure and building up compression per cylinder. Everything's kind of working a little bit more in unison instead of, you know, I got the, this pipe up front, which is much longer than the pipe in the back. They end in the exact same spot. Um, so that makes sense to me. That being said, I've got all the power I want or need, especially like, you know, unless you're racing, I, I could kind of see it if you are riding with a bunch of buddies, especially if said buddies have street bikes, um, and you're not able to keep up, but honestly, the 107 is not that far from the 114 performance wise. I mean, you can look at all the numbers, all the charts. It's, it's really not that far off. And, uh, you know, with that, I, I, I don't know. I, I don't see anybody truly, truly leaving me in the dust, especially once I get stage two and you start to look towards stage three and four. I don't see my, my two into two just getting completely dusted by a two into one right and i still to this day i've had this bike for over 5,000 miles i still to this day i've had this exhaust on for over 4,000 miles still to this day i walk into my garage and see my bike especially from the back i'm an ass man and that view from the back it's just ooh, cool like i'm telling you they are so sexy and they sound so good that in what my opinion is truly kind of a meager performance gain from two to two to two to one I will take that sound and that look all day long 
over anything that a 2 to 2 has got to offer because honestly everyone runs the 2 to 2 it's a part of the dyno bro package is the 2 into 1 and you know I ever since like I said Blockhead's the reason why I started my channel and furthermore than that Blockhead putting the sweepers on his iron and then putting sweepers on that low wider is why I wanted a Harley my dad's had a Harley his whole life uh, as long as I can remember I've always wanted a Harley but man as soon as I saw those Bassani sweepers it's like yo I'm getting an M8, I'm blacking it out, and I'm getting those damn sweepers on the bike. Like, that's just what it is. So, we're going to come up to a straightaway here, and I'm going to gas it. But I, I honestly have zero complaints. I don't see that there's too much of a difference in the performance-wise. Um, a little bit. I will agree to a little bit, but I don't see that there's too much. So, we're going to get in third gear about 3,000. It is wet, so I don't want to break my tire loose here but get to about 3k make sure there's no cops up ahead oh look a dry patch of road looks clear oh we'll wait and see what these two cars are here neither one look like cops and Woo, I saw 115 there they sound good, performance is great, you can haul ass. I, I, I don't see a two to two or a two to one just dusting me. Like I said, I, I don't see it. This bike's nasty, man. And you know, just the 107, I can't imagine stage two, stage three, stage four on this thing. Um, I, I just don't see it. So anyway, we're gonna cut the video there. Uh, I know it was kind of short, I already shot it once. I'm sure I'll do a follow up on it a little bit, but install is super easy, everything's super easy and there's just, what's not to love the bike looks great sounds great and has plenty of power unless you're you know racing and you're not doing that on a damn harley anyway so i just don't see it but peace